Right, we're here on the 18th green with Mark Robinson, who's the uh, artist in residence for the DP World Tour Championship. Right, welcome to the magazine, Mark. Hi, mate. I've caught you busy there working away. <laughs> yeah. So how long have you been the actual artist in residence for the championship? I've been the artist in residence for the, uh, since the uh, inauguration of the whole of the championship, so that was, uh, this is the fourth year now. Yeah, okay. So you're, cu you're currently painting what? You're painting a view down the 18th green? This, yeah, I'm just literally, I mean, on the Monday, I'll just pop around different holes and just do some quick um, watercolour sketches and stuff. And um, uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I'll be popped by the 18th green painting up there. So what kind of uh, what kind of techniques do you specialise in for doing this kind of painting? Um, well, I mean, basically, uh, for the stuff I'm doing today is very quick, so it's sort of, it tends to be uh, watercolours. Um, uh, when I'm doing the paint, the canvases for the, at the 18th, they'll either be oil or acrylic. I haven't quite decided yet. Um, yeah. And what made you actually sort of start painting painting golf and golfers? Uh, I got bored with painting uh, portraits of uh, dignitaries, and so <laughs> I was painting them for many years, and and uh, I just needed something new. Golf being my um, favourite uh, sport and everything else, I uh, first did a portrait of uh, Henrik Stenson and uh, my mates liked it and I thought, well, fair enough, let's give it a go. So I've been doing it for a good few years now. Yeah. And what, what's been the feedback from you know, some of the golfers? Have you actually approached the golfers and they've seen the paintings? Yeah, I mean, well, for instance, um, when I uh, did the, f uh, the first um, race to Dubai, I, did, uh, I was asked to do a portrait of the winner, which was Lee Westwood, and, um, and then I presented him with the, the, uh, the portrait um, straight after, well, actually it was February after the tournament. Um, and from then onwards, I was getting uh, commissions and so on. I mean, I've been commissioned by Pete Cowan and people like that, so, um, you know, coaches and players alike, and their families as well. So, it's been a good, been a good feedback there. Yeah, basically, and um, because I do the um, invitational as well, um, you know, you tend to meet some a lot of amateurs that are playing with the pros, and they think, you know, what do they want as a nice gift or whatever is a painting of them. You know, alongside a pro or, or whatever, so yeah, it sort of works on both the pro and uh, the amateur level, if you know what I mean. Yeah, totally. So, what's been your favourite moment that you've actually painted at these championships so far? Uh, favourite moment I've painted? Well, I wouldn't say. I mean, the thing is that I finish the. I, I tend to finish them in the studio afterwards. Um, but probably, I, I mean, it had to be the first year really because it was so exciting. You know, I mean, the, the Lee Westwood was playing so brilliantly and everything else. Um, but um, I think probably last year. I followed uh, Rory round on his uh, practice round, and I gathered the reference, um, you know, photographs basically. And when I got back, I started painting, um, you know, a lot of his portraits and everything else, which led to me getting an exhibition in, in Stormont in Belfast, where I come from. Um, and so that that was probably that was a big sort of turning point for me. Yeah. Oh, superb. So where 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 else in the world would you like to paint golf wise? <laughs> Is there a specific place that you'd love to do? I really would like to do more European tour events, um, and certainly the, um, up in the, the Swiss mountains would be nice. But um, there's a chance I may be doing some painting in Florida next year for PGA stuff. So um, fingers crossed on that. I mean, it's uh, again, you never really know, I and mean, you tend to sort of get the phone call and off you go. So yeah, fingers crossed. Okay, so when when you're painting actually on the days of the actual event. Um, what sort of feedback do people give you? Are they very interested in what you yeah, do? Yeah, I, mean, I mean that's the reason I like doing this, actually, to be honest with you, because most of the time you're stuck in a studio painting, um, you know, painting portraits by yourself, humming and you know, yeah. <laughs> talking to yourself. Um, so it's great. Yeah, you get a chance to actually chat to people, get some feedback. You know, whether it be good or bad. It's amazing how many people paint as well. You know, how many yeah. people out there that are, 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 are painting away. Yeah, it's great. You know. So you're obviously a golfer yourself. Um, uh -huh. who, who do you think is going to win the DP World Tour Championship? Ooh. Actually, I think Manicero is playing really well at the moment, um, obviously. Um, but I think uh, Ian Poulter probably. Right, great, great choice. Yeah. Okay, Mark, thanks for your time. Okay, we'll thank, you get thank back you. to work yeah, and we'll, we'll showcase some of your work on the actual page as well. Great, great website, yeah. Brilliant. All right, thanks again. Cheers.